Welcome back, guys, to, um, uh, another Pokemon video, which I haven't done in a long time. Well, a card opening video. And we have an evolving size booster box. And my favorite part about this is it can have Palpitoad in it. So, we're gonna look for the Palpitoad, uh, obviously the Rayquaza, and there's a bunch more. Um, I already poked a hole in the plastic, so, just... It is a little dented, but it's straight from the, uh, Pokemon company themselves, so. Alright, I forget how to do this. You gotta get it all the way in the back, I think. And then, poke it. There you go. Okay, so, there are, okay, Sylveon artwork. Umbreon artwork. Rayquaza artwork, and where's the fourth? Okay. Uh, Duraludon artwork? Okay, these two are from the other side, so I'm just gonna put these back the way they were, because I want to start with the left side. Okay. Need a Sylveon and an Umbreon. Okay. Push that back a little bit, and as you can see, we got the Rayquaza ETB uh, back in there for the Rayquaza luck. And first, what we're going to do is we're going to open one of each pack artwork, then we're going to go through the left side, then go through the right side, or whatever I feel like doing. Alright, so this is my first pack of Evolving Skies ever, so I don't know which way the uh card goes here you go uh four from the back i think yeah okay fighting energy crustal moon and sun badge toy catcher rog and rolla flabebe rapid strike swablu litleo chinchow a reverse lotad and a hollow right ride you. Okay, so gotta move this. We're gonna put all the poles right over in that area. I heard um and I've seen like a bunch of videos on it saying this set has like really good pole rates in the booster box. Like a lot better than normal. So hopefully that is happening in our box too. And we get a bunch of good cards. Alright, Fighting Energy again. Lombre. Rapid Strike Scroll of the Flying Dragon. That's cool. Fleshender. Lillipup. Nicket. Bergmite. Rog and Rolla. Flabebe. Reverse like Lucky Ice Pop. And a Milotic. Regular Rare. Alright. So, we've done... Rayquaza and Sylveon, now it's for Umbreon and... Okay. If I can get this open. Umbreon and Duraludon. I feel like Duraludon was a really weird choice. Like, I, I don't... It could have been, like, another one of the evolutions or something. Also, I don't know if I showed the code, so here you go. Okay, Fire Energy something new this time. Nuzleaf, Golduck, Rubber Gloves, Gossiflor, Fletchling, Scraggy, Hippotoss, Timpole. See, that's we just gotta get you to evolve. A Reverse Timpole. That's actually really weird. And a Altaria. And one thing I noticed is the dragon cards have like the little scratch marks up there and they have a like dragon thing down there. So it's actually a cool design they've done for this set. Because I, I don't... I think it might have been something like that on the, like, dragon-type only set. That was, like, a holiday set. I don't remember what it was called. But... Um... Yeah, I think it, they did that, uh, also on that set. So... Okay. Leaf Energy, Stormy Mountain, Boldor, 
Skiploom, Lotad, Teddy Ursa, Cryogonal, Nicket, Dwebble, Reverse Elemental Badge. Oh! What the? Zinnia's Resolve Rainbow. That's really early on, too. That's. Alright, so already off the bat, we've gotten a Rainbow Rare trainer making this box already really good and we got we literally got a hollow and a rainbow out of just two packs I mean four packs so this is a really nice card I'm gonna put that back there all right continue on with the left side still have not pulled a palpitoad which you know in four packs I'm not expecting to pull a palpitoad but out of the whole box I am I remember when uh, I got the Vivid Voltage Booster Box. Um, obviously I wanted to get, like, the Pikachu and all that, but, um, one, the main card I was looking for was for my deck, and it was a, uh, Leon, and it was just, like, a normal trainer. I didn't get it in the whole booster box. Like, literally, I'm not even kidding you, 36 packs, and I didn't get a single Leon trainer. So I'm hoping this isn't like the Vivid Voltage and doesn't give me a Palpito. <clears throat> okay, four from the back. Okay, Psychic Energy. Full Face Guard, Hypno, Vigoroth, Emolga, Wubat, Gossifor, Feebas, Hivotas, Reverse Pyroar. Ooh, Noivern V. Okay, that's a really cool card, too. Also, um, we're using the, uh, Champion's Path sleeves, because I still got a bunch of those. So. And, with the pulls that I've been seeing in this set, uh, I'm pretty sure we can still get, like, a bunch of V Maxes, Vs. I could even get like a more uh, alternate art. Oh, I didn't do four. I could even get more alternate arts. Like I could get more rainbows or gold cards. Like I saw someone with like a couple alternate arts, a uh, gold card, a rainbow card, V Maxes, bunch of Vs. Like they had an insane box. Another Smeargle. I think that's the first double up on a rare we've got. Oh, come on. This pack does not want to open. This packs just don't like being opened, I guess. Whoa, that is just a mess. Okay, move that off to the side. Code card. I already have a big stack. That I'm gonna have to clean. Water energy, Stormy Mountain, Shellgon, Ice Q, oh. Petalil, Pikachu, Pumpkaboo, Rufflet, Lotad, Rog and Roller Reverse, and a Lilligan. Regular rare. These packs are leaning forward for some reason. Code guard. Back. Okay, dark energy. Uh, rescue carrier, crystal cave, avalug, nicket, bergamite, rog and rolla, flabebe, swablu, gorgeist, reverse rare, and hollow zygarde. That's a really cool hollow. Okay. On to the next pack. We're probably around like halfway done with the left side already and already some amazing pulls so code card as you can see over here I got a huge stack piling up already okay leaf energy ursaring swoobat digging gloves drowsy scraggy feebass 
Hitmonchan, Slack Off, Reverse Q to Fly. Ooh, look at that. What the? Yeah, these boxes have really good pull rates. Look at that Jolteon just before I put it in the sleeve. Full Art Jolteon V. That is one of the, probably one of the coolest cards in this set. That is a really good card. It's probably my favorite we've pulled so far. And I know, I like, like the, the, my, uh, way of cards that I like is normally like rainbows, then golds, and then like trainers and rainbow trainers. And then it's like the V-Maxes or Full Art Vs, but this is easily topping the, uh, the rainbow for me. Because that is a really good card. Like, the rainbow is cool, but I don't even know who that is, to be honest. Uh, it's a, it's a really cool rainbow trainer, though, but this Jolteon is just really nice. Still no Palpitoad. Honestly, if I don't get a Palpitoad out of this box, I might just buy it off of, like, eBay or something. Because it'll only cost a couple cents, because no one likes Palpitoad. Except for me. Dwebble, Mareep, Fletchling, Shiftery. That's a new one. How many packs do we have left in this side? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. gonna put it like that. Six after this Ooh, left on the left side. And I'm gonna sort it so that we can tell which pulls came from the left side and which pulls came from the right side. Okay. Fire Energy, Bulldor, Fletchender, Shopping Center, Pikachu, Pumpkaboo, Rufflet, Lotad, Emolga, Reverse Tentacool, and a Flapple. Here, I'm just gonna make this, uh, just ready to go already. That's gonna be right there, is the left side pulls. And then this'll be the right side pulls, and they'll be facing to the left. <clears throat> already, this is a really good booster box, and I didn't even... Uh, take the time to actually look around at the booster box. So I will do that after this pack. Here you go. Okay, Psychic Energy, Skip Bloom, Raihan, Rabombi, Tentacle, Pumpkaboo, Bagon, Love Disc, C Dot, that's new, a uh, Reverse Lombre, and a Hollow Victini. That's pretty cool. Alright. So I'm just gonna, I need to put these back normally. Sit in, please. Okay. So, you know, you got the, uh, Rayquaza here, the back, obviously. On the right here, you got the Sylveon. Got the Umbreon down here, then the barcode down there. And then the back, um, if you want to pause and read that, that's the whole, like, description for Evolving Skies. It's honestly a really good looking box, and the, the set in general is like a nice variety of like art styles for the cards. Like, here's an example. Like, Lombre is like, like sort of painted, hand drawn, I don't know how to explain it. And then this is like, like if you compare to the two, you can see like they're, they're different types of art styles. And I feel like those are the most common in this set. Uh, they might be the only in the set, but I like that it has, like, the different types of art styles for the cards. Okay, there you go. And, in general, like, the pack artworks are nice and reflective. Really good artwork on them, too. And the box looks nice. Like, everything about this set is just really good. Galarian Zapdos Reverse. That's actually really cool. Let's see if we can, out of, like, this is the, this is one, and then three more after this. Let's see if we can get another good pull out of the uh, next, 
in the last four packs on the left side. Got Water Energy, Rubber Gloves, Copycat, Zwilius, Cutify, Pikachu, Applin, Lillipup, Amolga, Reverse Flappy. Ooh, and a Gyarados V. That's a pretty, that's a good artwork, honestly. Still doesn't top the uh, Jolteon, though. Alright. Three more packs left. Still no Palpster. We've opened, and if you count this, so there's 36 packs, 18 on each side, we've opened 16, 16 packs, right? This is the 16th pack, and we haven't gotten a palp toad, so I don't know. Oh, speak of the, speak of the devil, right there, 16th pack, here is palp toad. That is, that's just... Oh yeah, going straight in the sleeve. Look at that beautiful artwork. When I saw this, I got so excited because this is easily the best Palpatode card they've ever made. Like I have every Palpatode card they they've made. This artwork is so much better than all the other ones. Like this easily is it has to be my favorite Palpatode card, and one of the best pulls we got out of this box. Like I know it's not like a good card, but like, it's Palptoad, which is obviously my favorite Pokemon, and that's just really, like, I can't explain how much I like that artwork, because it's just so much better compared to all the other artworks on Palpatoad. Like, the left side is probably gonna be the winner, but I can't say that for sure. Because we'll have to do a recap of the left side once we're done. We'll do a full recap of the whole box once we're done the other side, too. Okay, this is the last pack of the left side. And it's a Rayquaza artwork. So maybe that's saying something. I know the Rayquaza is going to be probably like the uh, Rainbow Pikachu from Vivid Voltage. Like, it's going to be really expensive and rare. Alright, here you go. And I do think we're gonna get something on here, because I saw a little bit of a flash from the, like, inside of the pack. So, Tentacruel. Oh. Pumpkaboo, Bagon, Love Disc, C-Dot, Slack Off, Reverse Galarian Moltres. Oh my god, we just keep getting the Jolteons. We literally just keep getting the Jolteons. This is amazing. Look at that. First we get the Jolteon V full art, and then the Jolteon V Max. Look at that. That is amazing, especially for the last pull of the side. That is really good. So here's our left side recap. We got the uh, Jolteon V Max, Palpatode, Gyarados V, uh, Hollow Victini, Jolteon V full art, Hollow Zygarde, uh, Noivern V, Rainbow Zinnia's Resolve, and I think I remember who she is now, and then uh, Hollow Raichu. So, this, if this was, like, literally, if what I got right here was all I got out of the booster box, I would be happy with it. Because, first of all, Palpatode. The Jolteons are amazing. I got a Rainbow, which is, like, my favorite type of card. And... See, like I was saying, with this set, it has amazing pull rates. Like, it it has, first of all, really good cards. Like, some of the best cards in a set I've seen since, like, for a long time. And I may be a little biased because of the Palpatode, but honestly, like, all the other cards in the set just make the set so good. And the artwork for the packs, the cards, like, it is easily the best set that has come out in, like, at least, and I don't even think Vivid Voltage compares to this, but at least since Vivid Voltage. Oh, and one thing I forgot to say is, if any of you remember the, uh, Rainbow Rare Le uh, Leafeon hunt I did, uh, back on Ultra Prism, 
I did like two videos of it. Uh, there is a rainbow Leafeon in this set. So I can continue the hunt too. Also, Galarian, Hollow Galarian Moltres right there. Only two packs into the left, uh, left, I mean right side, which is making it look better than the left side because left side took, well, also, no, left side also took two packs to get a good card. So. Mm, Dark Energy, Raihan, Rabombi, Flaffy, Sableye, Teddy Ursa, Mareep, Zora, Tentacle, Aroma Lady. That's a really cool Drampa art. Right? It's a normal card, but that is a nice art. First one we've seen of that so far. And I've gotten like four or five Timples already. One Palpitoad, four or five Timples, no Seismitoad, which I'm actually happy about because I hate Seismitoad. Seismitoad sucks. I don't like it. <laughs> It should have just stopped at Palpitoad, so that Palpitoad could have get all the good cards. And that's what I always say, because normally the only things that get good cards are the fully evolved forms. Well, besides Pikachu. Pikachu is Pikachu. But, like, if Palpitoad was the last, last in the chain, it was just, like, um, uh, Timple, then Palpitoad. I, I would have been so pleased with that, because then he would get all the good cards. Like, I, w I would get Palpitoad EXs, or GXs, or Vs, VMAXs, like, oh, it would be so nice. Okay, Shopping Center. Ooh, Hollow Regielucky. That's a nice card. Okay, so far, couple packs in to uh, the right side. And we've gotten two hollows, which is pretty good. I'm just gonna move over the uh, cards a little bit so they're not as much on the play mat. Okay. So much to clean up later, but that's all right. It's worth getting all these good cards. So, next pack in the uh, box. Code card. Okay. Psychic Energy. Crustal. Rescue Carrier. Crystal Cave. Rog and Rolla. Wobbuffet. Hoppip. Swablu. Zora. Marshadow. Shiftry. Marshadow is new. There was a couple new cards in there. Like two, I think. One thing I like about, like, these big Pokemon sets is when you open like a box or a ETB or like something for the set, you'll you'll be getting a lot of the new cards because this one has so many cards. I mean, you get a bunch of doubles, but sometimes you'll get the new ones and it's really good. Like that Stoutland is new. I don't even haven't seen that before. So, okay, how many packs do we have left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten packs left, guys. And the last pack, somehow, just like the, uh, the left side is a Rayquaza. Like, honestly, I don't, I don't know. I think that might have been on purpose or something. But, last pack on the, uh, right side is the same as it was on the left side, being a Rayquaza. That would be so funny if the last pull of the box we got was like a Rayquaza. Okay, here's Zinnia as a normal trainer. Copycat, Cryogonal, Nicket, Dwebble, Rufflet, Roggenrola, Reverse Stoutland, Milotic. The, uh, the right side is really not treating me well so far. I've gotten three hollows out of like nine packs. So, compared to the left side, it's going to need a lot to catch up.
Okay, Leaf Energy, Bulldower, Skip Bloom, Fletchender, C Dot, Lillipup, Bagon, Litleo, Lotad, Spirit Mask, and Atropius. Those are new. Alright. Yeah, like I said, this right side really is being stingy. Doesn't want to give me anything. It might be full packed at the end of the it might be full packed at the end of the box. Like the the last couple packs in the side are just all stacked. Or it could just not have anything. I'd still be happy though because I've already gotten a bunch of good cards. But I know I still can get a lot more compared to the uh other videos I watch. So hopefully we do get even more lucky then. Oh yeah, look at that. Full art copycat trainer. That is a really cool card. That's nice. Alright. May have taken a couple packs more than the uh, left side. Because the left side started off hot and was hot throughout the whole thing. And right side sort of was being stingy, but we got the full art copycat. Which is really, that's, that's worth it. For the couple of, like, dud packs, it's worth it. Because that's a really good card. And like I was saying, maybe the end of the box here just has so much stuff. You know, we you never know until you open the box. So, we could just get lucky and get a bunch more stuff. See? Two in a row. Sylveon V. The, uh, the right side is really starting to heat up here. Sylveon isn't... Eh. I mean, it's the same as what's on the pack artwork, I think. I think it's what's on the pack artwork, but, um... No Leafeon so far, I do have to say. I haven't seen a single Leafeon. Or Umbreon. Well, yeah, no Umbreon, no Leafeon, just Sylveon, Jolteon. No Rayquaza either, which obviously is going to be really rare, so I'm not complaining about that. Um... Yeah, but maybe this right side is just ready to give us some heat. Like, look, that's a double up, the first double up of the box, but hollow Regilucky. That's three pulls in a row, and we have four packs left. So, we, uh, I'm gonna go a little bit slower with these last packs, just because they are the last packs of the box, and I don't really see Pokemon cards that often, so... I gotta appreciate the last packs. Well, appreciate the whole box, obviously, but... Take some time into the last packs. Just to, uh... You know. Gorgeist, Sharpedo. Okay. So, it was on, like, a 3-4 card streak there. Now it's slowing down, but we still got 3 packs. And... Last pack artwork is a Rayquaza, so maybe it's all leading up to that. Avalog, Ribbon Badge, Zoelius, Fletchling, Scraggy, Hippotoss, Timple, Litleo, Flappy, and a Flapple. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, there's three packs left. Not. Oh. One of them was, like, hidden in between the first one and the third one. I thought there was only two. Okay, final three packs, guys. Last pack artwork, like I keep saying, I don't know why I keep saying it, but is Rayquaza. Could mean something. Could just be there. You never know. I don't think... I honestly don't think the right side is gonna give us anything. At this point, might give us a Palpatode, but you know, it's starting to cool down now. That's two Sharpedo regular rares in a row. So, maybe in my last two packs, I can get a Palpatode, but it's not likely, seeing as how I've only gotten one out of all of these. So, I think I just mixed it on accident. That's all right. Okay, Lantern, Earth Ring, Crustle, Pikachu, C Dot, Lily Pup, Bagon, Litleo, Reverse Sharpedo, Ooh, Umbreon V. So we've gotten 
well, we haven't gotten normal Jolteon V, but we did get the full RP. So we've gotten every Leafeon, I mean, every Eevee, except for Leafeon. Okay, does this card want to stand, maybe? There you go. Okay, last pack. Got to put some luck into it. Celestial Storm Box right there. Put it on the Pikachu. Put it in front of these cards. Hit it on the booster box. All right. Last pack of the booster box. Will it be lucky? Probably not. Because the right side was mean to us. But. Well, not mean. It didn't, I'm just saying it didn't give us as much as the left side. No Palpitoad. There's a normal Eevee. Cutify. Reverse Psyduck. And... Gigalith, regular rare. Alright, guys. So, here's the right side recap. We got an Umbreon V, Regieleki Hollow, Sylveon V, Copycat Full Art, and then Regie uh, Regieleki Hollow and a Galarian Moltres Hollow. Left side recap is Jolteon V Max, Palpatode, Gyarados V, Victini Hollow, Jolteon V Full Art, Zygarde, Noivern V, Rainbow, Zinnia's Resolve, and a Hollow Raichu. So, that's going to be it for uh, this video, guys. Um, I might come back with, like, more Evolving Skies. Not Obviously not a, another booster box, because I'm not... Uh, I don't... I rarely get booster boxes, and I've never gotten one of the same set. So, I'll be... I might be back with more Evolving Skies. Might not be back in the uh, TCG videos for a while, but... Who knows? Um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.